Hey YouTube. So today I'm going to be giving you a story time on the time that I had the worst, the worst boyfriend ever. So it started about last year and some months ago. Um, it started around June 2016. And we had met on Instagram. So he hit me up and he was like, hey, you're beautiful. I would like to get to know you, da, 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 da. So, I mean, we was cordial. Everything was cool. Then he was like, I want to link up with you. So I'm like, okay, cool. Like, where you want to link up at? He was like, Dave and Buster's. And I'm like, oh, okay, cool. That's that's fine. I see you at Dave and Buster's. So I finally seen him at Dave and Buster's. He was like, oh, good to meet you, da, 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 da. I've been wanting this forever. And I was like, oh. And he was like, hey, so can I get your number? I'm like, cool. So ever since then, like, we were texting and calling. We followed each other on Snapchat. We followed each other on Twitter. Then we text more from Instagram. It was just, everything was just perfect. So then he finally gets to know me even more. And he met my family. We um hung out a lot. And... We did the do. <laughs> All right. <laughs> All right, but anyway, that's what I was saying. Like everything was going good, pretty much. But um, one started when I was at my church event and he was in the house, and he was like, I forgot what we were arguing about. It was over something very stupid, like like very stupid. And he was, and I was like, um, oh, I'm sorry, I didn't mention that we broke up. <clears throat> So the next day he hit me up. He was like, man, I want you back. And I was like, no, like, GTF, I have a boyfriend. It was a lie, but I don't have to make myself. <laughs> so he was like, oh, but that's all good. And I was like, oh, really? He was like, yeah, whole time you the side chick. I didn't got this other girl. I didn't did this. I didn't did that. Da, 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 da. So then he had a nerve, the nerve to freaking send me pictures of him and the girl doing it right at this point i'm in my church function and i went to what i call my best friend i'm like best friend like i can't believe this just happened she like what girl what and i told her everything and i just instantly started like bawling in tears you never was i've, I've never cried over a dude like that hard like but i was bawling in tears like it was so crazy so then i finally text him back <clears throat> And I was like, whole time slim, like, I was playing with you. I didn't have no other dude. And he was like, oh, really? For real? And I was like, yeah, I don't have no other dude. And he was feeling so stupid. So that day, I broke up with him, and I never talked to him again. So then, like, recently, about, like, I want to say, like, four months ago, Slim hit me up. And he was like, hey, what's up? How you doing? Delete. The next he was like, oh, um, can we get back together? Delete. Then he was like, how you been? Delete. <laughs> like, poo, I don't want to be with you no more. Like, you didn't tell me the truth and everything. So, <clears throat> then, um, so my best friend decides to hit him up and was like, look, you need to stop talking to my best friend. You got the game can twist it. We will pull up on you, Slim. So he was then he started threatening like he was gonna come fight me and all this other stuff. Guess what this girl did? Put the bonnet on, put the cap on, put the sweatpants on, put the t-shirt on, it was like come outside, I'm ready. Cause guess what? I don't play no games with these niggas. Like I really don't. Cause at the end of the day, y'all got me messed up. <sighs> anyway. <laughs> but I guess that's all there is to say, like, that's the time that I had the worst boyfriend ever.